What is up everybody, this is Easy, Easy Street Gaming, bringing you another Brutal Age video. This is on the new 5 star partner, Cha Cha, I believe, it's called Cha Cha, odd name, must say that. Uh, this is going to be maybe one of the most incredible replays that I've ever shown. I couldn't believe it when I saw it. Don't have a lot of replays, I, I was asking for them and we just don't have a lot of people that were able to use them in ranked matches quite yet. And that's where most of our, of our replays come from. We're gonna break down each one real, real quick. Uh, I don't have. A, I'm not gonna do the war patterns today, and I know a, a lot of people want to know the war patterns on 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 all the partners, but just don't have enough information on them yet to give to give good advice on war patterns. Uh, we're gonna start off with the blue. I'm gonna I'm kind of going in order from least to best as far as what I can tell so far. I think the best part of the blue would be the leader skill. She has resistance as a leader skill. It's 41% resistance. And because I just haven't seen enough of blue's attacks, I'm, I'm just going to go by what is being said in, uh, as far as the description. And uh, we're going to have to kind of go from there. I've heard a little bit about red and seeing green in action. So we have a little more information on red and green. Um, as far as blue legion skill, and I, and I like the Legion skills. Blue is 50% uh, morale for Shaman, and that's increased for your uh, for your partners. I'm sorry, for your army, if that partner survives till the end. Her first skill, Blue's first skill, is called the Bloody Hunt. And I'll just give a brief breakdown of what each of the skills are. Um, this one is a, she gets 30% uh, health points back. On the damage that she deals so if she deals a thousand damage on, on us on the attack she'll get 30% uh, back so 300 back now the se second skill is a buff for her team and then if she doesn't have a lot of teammates left in the battle then it's a bigger buff for herself and it's kind of got several layers to it but basically it's a buff of the action bar for 50% for her teammates and if she doesn't have a lot of teammates in. Then she gets a buff for speed and attack on herself, I believe. Um, so it's kind of a... It's a super buff. This is called that. <laughs> That's, that may be her best skill. I'm not sure. Um, her third skill is called Dark Doom. Dark Doom is, ca is a debuff on all enemies. She attacks all enemies with a 75% chance to replace their buff with a debuff. So it's kind of dual action. She takes away whatever buff they have with a debuff. And it's got several different uh, boosts to it. It's not affected by a bunch of the uh, a bunch of buffs like uh, immunity or whatever. So as a six star, if you're looking at the if you're looking at our main stats, uh, hit points, the the attack, the defense, nothing really just jumps out at you. I, I guess 413 for attacks, not not terrible. So she looks like she's going to be a a, uh, a support partner. Although they describe her as a powerful partner Now you get into red and green it things change a little bit red Starts out at 4,000 hit points got my number two uh, out of the two out of three and, and This is kind of like preliminary look at it. You know there's there, there could be changes in my opinion about it after I see a lot of them Again they the inspire means that for her legion skill she's going to boost the morale of your team and she boosts the, the beastmaster remember whatever color the partner is it affects that particular part uh, the the red is going to always affect the beastmaster the blue is going to affect the shaman and the green is going <clears> to <throat> affect the warrior her leader skill is speed and the speed i believe is a little more than like your blue black shaman so it's another level up but I believe if you if you look at the five star and the four star, blue black shaman starts off at a four star, so his boost for speed is a little less. I believe I don't I don't really have everything in front of me. I'm not as prepared as normal. I suck. <laughs> Getting into reds first, 
skill is it's the same as the I believe the first skill is the same on all of them it's called bloody hunt and it's a it's an attack where she will get 30% of her damage dealt back in health so as she's damaging the opponent she's also regaining her health and this is this is a commonality throughout all three colors uh, she, as she's attacking she's getting health back and some in some cases extreme which we'll go we'll see that a little more in, in green and, and, and in red too second attack is called lethal glaives I believe that's how you spell it I torch things on how I spelled and pronounced them so who knows and this is an, an attack all enemy two times and if they have a debuff then it guarantees a critical rate attack so that's a little hint towards what kind of war pattern you may want you know that if her critical attack is getting raised by one of her attacks you may want to just boost up her critical rate anyway uh, third attack her big attack is called bloodlust uh, she will she revives immediately after being defeated and uh, she'll steal 80% from the enemy with the highest hit point so that's a big that's that's taking almost all their health but it's got a 12 round CD so until you get her CD way down, which the more uh, the more times you feed uh, Cha Cha a Cha Cha, <laughs> the more times you'll be able to increase her skill level, and you can probably get that down to about six. So, but still, eighty percent. I mean, you have certain partners out there that you're going to be facing that whose whose health points may be up in the twenty thirty thousand range. So that could be a thirty thousand uh, twenty thousand uh, depletion in one 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 strike. Now going on to the number one, at least in Easy's rating, number one is the green cha cha, and we have the replay which has green in it, and you'll see exactly why I, I believe that green is the number one. And she may be, if it's a she, I believe it's a she, maybe the most powerful partner in the game. I, I was amazed at what I saw. Leader skill is 33% attack. And going back to my theory on the attacks, because I don't know the exact uh, definition of it. Being a five star, she has 33% instead of your like uh, your demon killers that have that have 25%, but they start off as a four star, so they're not quite as strong. And remember, these new partners don't get the awakening quite yet, so they, she can only go up to six star. And Legion skills as a 50% boost to your morale for your uh, for your warriors. And once again, green, I believe, does warrior throughout all of the partners. Now, getting into her actual skills, her first attack is the Bloody Hunt, which is the same as, as the others. So, her first attack is whatever damage she deals on the enemy, she will get 30% of that back in health points for herself. Now, the interesting thing was that I noticed, and you'll notice this too, because now I'm pointing it out. I don't think she got an attack off in the replay that we're about to see. She was definitely the most important partner on the entire battlefield, by far. But yet she never did get an attack off. So how 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 strong is that to not even have to attack to be useful? Her second skill, Lethal Waves, is the, she shares this with Red, and this is uh, she'll attack all enemies two times, and any target that has a debuff already will guarantee a critical rate attack. So both the first and second skills are pretty powerful. I didn't get to see it, but they are powerful in theory. <laughs> Her third skill is called Life Drain. This is the number one skill for the number one Cha Cha. It revives. It. She revives immediately after her death. And if their teammates have more than thirty percent health, then she will steal ten percent from each of her teammates. And you'll see why right now. Why that is such a big deal. So in the replay, this is the first look at the green cha-cha. This is a replay from Splash in uh, ranked matches, in the elite ranked matches. Keep in mind, this is a level 15 or 17 cha-cha, so it's not even close to maxed. And also, see if you can find, count how many times she attacks. I'm going to count for us how many times that she ends up uh, dying and coming back to life. Her skill now is every time that she's defeated, she will automatically come back and take 10% from each of her teammates. And when you have some big partners in there like the the Blue Nomad, who has sometimes 20,000 bonus hit points, 
That's a that's a pretty big boost that she can get right back from her teammates. There's the fourth death right there. Now I've already I've started to think. Okay, how can you take how can you take her out uh, if, if you get her on your team? You know, that's a big big plus right there. I believe what we're gonna have to do is focus on who we are fighting with because the problem that Splash had wasn't even that she wouldn't die. It's the fact that that's all that that his team attacked. So he didn't know any. Now now he'll be able to plan as well. Um, but just going in blind, you don't really know what's going on. It's a brand new hero, and at level 17, you're really probably not worried about it. But I don't think he anticipated. No one would have anticipated that his his team would only attack her over and over, and it was impossible to kill her. At least so far, we'll see how it plays out. And here I am talking for Splash. You're welcome. <laughs> but I'm sure he was frustrated and wondering, wow, what am I going to do to kill this one? There's number 10. Number 10. Tenth time she's died. And come back to life. And yet still has not attacked the first time. Number 11. So, if you get the green cha-cha, or if you're facing her... Especially if you're facing her, because I think that's going to be more important to most people. Because there will be more people facing her than, than using her. Leave a comment. I want. I'm interested in to see how 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 you did exactly how you managed the fight because she took she took all of his partners right out of this. <laughs> so there's there's the new new partner, Cha Cha. Green is tough, tough as nails. She doesn't stay alive very long, but she comes back every time, so that kind of makes it irrelevant how many times she dies. Hope you enjoyed the video. In about an hour or two, you'll see the next video come through. It's, a, it's the next three-star partner in the partner guide come through. It's been a little delay, but they're coming out too, so hope to see you guys there. Till next time, it's been easy. Take care, everybody.